The fight for control over the Western Sahara region is one of Africa's longest-running territorial disputes. The Polisario Front, which says the territory belongs to ethnic Sahrawis, waged a guerrilla war after Morocco took over the area from colonial Spain in 1975, until a UN brokered ceasefire in 1991. UN attempts to hold a referendum on the future of the region have failed since then, with the two sides deadlocked. I want to bring my contribution to the negotiations launched in order to resolve these long-standing differences and to start the talk so that the refugee Sahrawi can return home to Western Sahara with dignity. Ban met with Mauritania's President Mohamed Aziz, where he commended him for his strong support to the UN mediation efforts on Western Sahara. Rabat wants Western Sahara, which is rich in phosphates and possibly offshore oil and gas, to be an autonomous part of Morocco and disagree with Polisario over who should take part in the referendum. Morocco's king insisted last year that only the autonomy plan was acceptable. Many of the Sahrawis who fled the fighting in Western Sahara have been living in refugee camps in harsh Tindof area in Algeria for nearly 40 years. Algeria backed Polisario in the conflict against Morocco. Catherine Ogunde, CCTV.